Hi, my name's Charles Funk. I'm the CEO of Heliostar Metals, HSTR in Canada and HSTXF is our ticker code in the US. Uh, we've been talking a lot recently about our spectacular results from Unger. You know, we think it's a multi-million ounce district in Alaska. It's got very high grade hits that we've been delivering consistently over the last few months. But today we're actually talking about something completely different, a whole nother string to Heliostar's bow. It's our projects in Northern Mexico, in Sonora. We have three projects there that we each thought could be company making projects. And one of those, Kumaro, has taken a huge step forward this week. It's part of the Picacho district that we share with Silvercrest. I think the fact that we have it and Silvercrest have it probably speak to the pedigree given our track records um, in, in this part of the world. And what we announced was dozens and dozens of intercepts on surface, literally just surface sampling a vein that we found that you know, up to five metres at 12.6 grams gold equivalent, um, high grade gold with a nice silver credit, lots of hits that could easily be in an open pit target and it's never been followed up on. So we're going to drill underneath. We've only just got to continue to hit the same grades underneath. Um, there's every reason that that should be the case and we can start building a resource. And why it's such an exciting value proposition or why it's a game changing value proposition really is that the economic hurdle in this part of the world is incredibly low. We have three mines within trucking distance. There's the first majestic Santa Elena mine, there's Equinox Gold's Mercedes mine, and Silvercrest is building Las Chispas. In fact, this project or the ground around it was picked up in the past with exactly this in mind to be a satellite ore source to these mills. And so if we could just extend that mineralization down 100 meters, deliver 200,000 ounces, even conservatively at $25 an ounce, that's double our market cap. So what we're doing now is changing our plan. Given that sentiment is low in, in the gold industry more broadly, we can focus on delivering a really near-term win. And when I mean near-term, I'm talking months. So we will step down and drill that target in November this year, have results at the very beginning of next year, and even as little as 200,000 ounces would be a game changer for our company. We think, though, this package can contain much more. There's a lot more veins that have never been drilled. Um, but just at the start, there's a huge value proposition. You don't normally talk about value plays with junior explorers, but you know, with what we have in Alaska and now these results, you know, I think Heliostar represents a, a deep value play that will be unearthed in the next couple of months. A Heliostar, our brand is, is high-grade districts and that we can unlock. You know, we're a team of discoverers who's delivered. You know, you look at Wiesler last year, you look at what we've delivered in Alaska. Now we've got this in Mexico. So stay tuned for lots of news. Um, we'll be delivering more results from as we drill and expand on what we've just found here in Mexico. We've got the multi-million ounce potential in Alaska. You know, back teams that know how to make discoveries and we'll deliver news flow over the next few months for you to support that. So thank you very much for listening and, and stay tuned. It's an exciting winter for us.